Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just to let you know that if you are using the Photos app and are tied into the Google ecosystem, that Google now is rolling out the same functionality that was previously available um, on Android devices and Chromebooks, where they are now introducing a new redesigned web-based editor to the Photos app online. So just to let you know about this, as mentioned, if you do use the Photos app, in particularly the web-based version. Now, if we click on an image and a photo, just to walk through this step-by-step -step for today's video, apparently there's a new in interface with some new features. And uh, first of all, if we head up to this edit uh, tab and button, when you first um, click on an image, you'll see a new try the new editor option at the top here, at the top right. And if you click on that, uh, you will be met with more or less the same user interface that was previously available on your phone, as an example. And at first, we get the suggestions tab, where now you'll see enhance, uh, warm, cool. So those are just some suggestions for different tones uh, that you can bring to your image and your photo. And if you want to use dynamic, uh, you have to be signed up with a Google One paid subscription to use dynamic. And uh, moving on to the next... And that's the next tab, which is the crop. So if we click on that, quite a lot going on here where we've got some preset aspect ratios now that are available. So we've got free, original, 16.9, 9.16, 4x5, 4.3, 3x4, and so on. So you get the general idea. And then we've got this reset button, which will just place everything back to how it was originally. And under the image here, you can actually drag to adjust. And we've also got this rotation control here to the left, which obviously lets you rotate your image. So those are just a couple of um, preset aspect ratios and some adjustments you can make uh, with the actual uh, crop uh, tab and interface. And then moving on to the next uh, tab, um, third from the left and second from the right, we've got this adjust tab. And yeah, you'll see, you can now see all of the sliders basically that they pop out and they're up front and center. So once again, HDR is for only for uh, Google One subscriptions, but you've got brightness, contrast, white point highlights, shadow, a uh, black point, and so on. And then for the last one, uh, filters, um, this has been basically relocated. So there's not really too much new that's going on here. It's just uh, this has been relocated now when it comes to the actual uh, filters and adjustments and so on that you can make with these new features that have rolled out. So just letting you know about this, that um, these are the new um, uh, editor, web-based editor redesign features that are now rolling out uh, to the Photos app online and just giving you a heads up um, if you are tied into the Google, Google ecosystem and are using the online version of Photos. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.